Okay, if you've just done question five, this is actually a chance to practice what we covered in question five. So uh, again, it might be an idea. Pause the video, have a go at it, and then compress, press play and check the answer. So write an algorithm in pseudocode. Teacher wants to enter the test scores for their class. Ask the teacher to enter how many pupils are in their class. The teacher then enters the scores as numbers. So looking at this question, we have an input here where we need to find out how many pupils are in the class because we're going to need that to set up our loop. Um, and our loop will be a for loop because we'll know exactly how many times it's going to need to repeat because it will be the number that's entered. And then we have another input where we're just entering the scores for the class. So the first thing we need to do is ask the teacher how many pupils are in their class and then we're inputting that as a variable pupils or it could be pupil num, it could be class num, whatever you want, as long as it makes sense. Um, let's go ahead and declare that as an integer and then we can use that integer to set up our for loop for i assign 1 to pupils. Inside the loop, we're going to do this input. So we're going to uh, input the score, put a message on the screen. We've just created another variable, so let's declare score as an integer. And then finally, we need to finish the uh, loop structure, the for loop here. Okay, uh, that's it. Very short one. Thank you very much. On to the next one.